Hi, Matt B, M2M here. Um, yeah, no hell, no holly effect dark background stuff anymore because it didn't really work. It was a bit silly, really, just a bit of fun anyway. Uh, so yeah, just my normal cheerful self and my, my um, scruffy, untidy home. Um, so anyway, I just want to do a quick video and it's about a YouTuber by, or Flat Earth YouTuber by the name of Flatsoid FE. Um, he seems to have a bit of a problem with an astronaut, namely um, Helen, sorry, Megan MacArthur. Um, and he seems to have a bit of a problem with her hair for some reason. Um, but before we get into it, um, if you haven't done so already, please hit the subscribe button below and hit the bell icon and you'll be notified when I upload more videos and hit the thumbs up. Um, and also as well, above all, please comment below, let me know how I'll get on, or if you've got anything you want to say, then comment, because it all helps as well to drive traffic to the video. So anyway, let's uh, find out what it's all about, roll the credits, and we'll get into it. Okay, so this is the video in question um, by Flatsoid FE entitled Actonauts Assemble. Uh, Actonauts is a term used by some FEs because obviously it signifies that the astronauts um, are all actors. Uh, okay, so let's play the video. Let's see. Oh, I'm going to keep the sound off um, because I don't want to get a strike for music um, because in the video it just plays music. Um, he doesn't talk. It's just the uh, text on the screen. Um, so let's play the video and find out what's going on. Megan MacArthur and ESA. Are supposedly aboard the ISS. Yep, they are ISS. Trying to capture, or they do capture, Northbrook Grumman Cygnus spacecraft using the Candoran 2. Correct. Anyone notice anything strange? Nope, I don't. Eyes looking okay at her hair. She's got, got a problem with her hair. Concentrate on Megan's ponytail. Okay. I'll concentrate on Megan's ponytail. Concentrating. 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 See how every strand just sticks to its position. Well, I can see some movement there. So, yeah, and... Yeah, it's doing what I suspect it would do aboard the ISS, so it doesn't see anything unusual. I can see something quite interesting, which I'll come back to in a minute. Yeah, I'm looking at the hope. Thanks for pointing out the ponytail again. What's with the hair gel? You're not fake, you say, Globies. Okay, so um, what's wrong with having hair gel on the ISS? Why wouldn't she have a hair gel on the ass? Maybe she puts it in a ponytail, she puts hair gel on it, so it doesn't move about so much. And? So he says, not fake, you say, Globies. Okay. Okay, let's compare it to a zero-G plane. Okay, let's do that. Okay, some people in the vomit comment or zero-G plane. Oh, a lady redhead, a lady uh, with um, much longer hair. Notice how uh, wavy hair, her hair is. Well, yeah, her hair's not in a ponytail and hasn't got hair gel in it, and it's much longer. And? They're having a great time. Yeah, love to do that. Yeah, we're comparing it. Comparing, side by side, yeah, and? Helen, uh, sorry, Megan MacArthur, beg your pardon, might have hair gel in it. The other lady doesn't. And? What's this proving exactly? I can't see what it proves at all. Okay. So ask me again. Why I call them uh, actonauts. Well, Flat Sword, I'm not going to call you, call, ask you why you call them uh, actonauts, because that's pretty clear. But your um, argument in this video is a bit weak, to say the least. But you've actually ignored one very important thing. 
and let's rewind and have a look. And what I want you to do is concentrate on the back of the um, Megan MacArthur's neck. See the necklace? Ooh, how's it doing that? Flatsoid? Oh look, see? The necklace? Can you see the necklace in the back of the neck? How's the pendant on the necklace doing that then? Ooh. And how does that happen? There it is again, look, see? The pendant moving, the back of her neck is floating. How does that happen, I wonder? But it's funny enough, I did actually comment on the video and asked him this very question. And here it is. So I said, why are you ignoring her necklace flat sword? What causes that move it to move the way it is moving? And he said, never did. He apparently not wasn't ignoring. I knew your defense would bring it up. Really? Did you really flat sword? I doubt it very much. So many ways to fake the necklace to do what it is doing. But I was specifically concentrating on the hair. Of course you were flat sword. But as I've just shown, it means absolutely nothing whatsoever. So, as I've replied there, here's my challenge to you, Flatsoid. If there's so many ways to fake the necklace to do what it was doing, then please demonstrate it. Show me and explain, well, show us and explain to us exactly how this is done. And demonstrate it in a video. I really would like to see that. Until then, I'm just going to dismiss that you absolutely no idea what you're talking about. And dismiss video is just weak evidence because there's no evidence at all. So sorry, Flatsoid, but your silly little video has just been burned.